Hey folks, Dave here at Thunder Mesa Studio. And you know, when I'm not working on projects, sometimes I just like to sit back, relax, and watch the trains run. Wouldn't you? It's a busy morning at Thunder Mesa Depot, with an eastbound stock train and a westbound mix with supplies for the mines at Calico, both ready to depart. The eastbound train leaves first, with trusty Combine 101 at the rear, loaded with rowdy drovers and trail hands, and the outgoing mail. The westbound train leaves a little behind schedule and the engineer will need to push number seven to make up some time. Meanwhile, a short ore train is departing the rich diggings at Calico Mountain, bound for the mill at Thunder Mesa. The eastbound stock train works its way through Indian country before making a brief mail stop at Rainbow Ridge. Lucky passengers aboard the westbound mix are treated to the sight of a well-timed eruption at Old Unfaithful Geyser. Then it's on through Nature's Wonderland and Rainbow Caverns before passing the Thunder Mesa bound ore train at Hanging Rock. The Helengon mine might be about played out, but rumor has it the engineer of our ore train has a gal over at Olsen and Furlow's place, and he never complains about taking a break on the siding there. But it's back to work before long, and none too soon. By the sound of that thunder, there's likely another gully washer blowing in.
Old Unfaithful certainly is active today. Over by Circle D Ranch, the eastbound mix is almost to Calico. Those mine timbers and other supplies will be offloaded at the station there. Then it's a quick jaunt up to the turnaround at Tumbleweed. The westbound stock train is ready to depart Rainbow Ridge for the last leg up to Los Feliz Junction, where those cattle cars will be switched to the Santa Fe, Denver, and Carrollwood Railroad, bound for the stockyards of Kansas. Coming through the cactus forest, the ore train is almost to Thunder Mesa Mill, but the engineer will need to perform a runaround maneuver before he can switch those loaded ore cars to a mill siding. Back in Calico, the eastbound mix is ready to depart. Beyond Calico Mountain is the Y at Tumbleweed, where our eastbound is turned and becomes the westbound mix on a return trip to Thunder Mesa. Looks like the engineer is still trying to make up some time. After a similar turn at Los Feliz Junction, Engine 4 now pulls the eastbound mail. First stop, Rainbow Ridge.
By late afternoon, the westbound mix arrives back in Thunder Mesa. Ten minutes early, as it turns out. The uh, boss might need to have a talk with that engineer about throttle control. The westbound departs Rainbow Ridge, then it's a leisurely journey back through Indian Country before arriving once again at the Thunder Mesa Depot. Now there's freight, passengers, and mail to offload. A little switching to be done, some maintenance by the shop crews, and paperwork to be filed by the station agent. The locomotive and train crews will switch out for the night, and all will be made ready for tomorrow's business. And that, my friends, is a pretty typical day in the life of the Thunder Mesa Mining Company Railroad. Thanks for coming along for the ride. I'll see you next time, amigos. Adios for now.